Okay, this is my virtual machine that I've set up to play RCT2 in Windows 7. All I've done is simply install VMware, put Windows XP on it, and install RCT2 and its expansions. And the game comes up in a nice window. Hopefully, it doesn't cause the crashes that I normally get if I install RCT2 by itself. And yeah, I'll just have a quick press around in Crazy Castle just to show it works. The right mouse sensitivity is really high, so if I move the mouse so much as maybe four or five millimeters, this is how much movement I get. So that is quite tricky, but it doesn't render the game unplayable, it just makes it slightly more difficult to move around. And you can still move the mouse to the edge of the screen and scroll it like this if you wish. Um, yeah. As you can probably tell, I've got a really monotonous voice, so. If you'd like me to do NLP of RCT2 or Liquid of Landscapes or something, feel free. But I can understand if nobody would want such a thing. I'd bore them to death. Yeah, it's just a proof of concept video just to show that it works. Um, by the same method, anyone else that would make a much better job of doing Let's Plays than I will can do the exact same thing. VMware is free, um, but you will obviously need to have RCT2 in some form of disk image. I don't know if you can just use physical CD-ROMs with VMware, I suspect you probably can, but I've not tested it. Um, I do own RCT2 and its expansions, but I've got no idea what I did with the disks. So this is just an ISO that's come off the internet. Naughty naughty. Okay, well I've, uh, I've shown that this all works fair enough, so have fun.